if we wind up having a C-section, what options are limited to us at that point, like with skin-to-skin -skin contact and that kind of thing? Unless it's like a dramatic emergency and they actually have to put you out, you will be fully aware of what's going on. And so you can actually be as participatory as within reason. I mean, you can have them set up a mirror and you could watch if you want to. You can have them deliver the baby and bring the baby right up to you. So you can have the baby on your chest and put the baby to the breast and skin to skin, or you can hold your baby skin to skin um, and keep your baby with you. So um, other than the fact that you can't you know, sit up and hold your baby, um, they're gonna have to you know, finish stitching you. You should have that beautiful bonding experience. For me, that brings up two issues. One is this whole idea of the golden hour. And what that means is that after a baby is born, they have this most beautiful state of quiet, contemplative alertness. They're calm. They're interested in nursing. They're looking around, sometimes they have little eyes peeping around, kind of seeing the environment. And then after an hour or so, they oftentimes go to sleep. And they may well not be interested in nursing for another 12 hours or even 24 hours sometimes. Um, and they may be mostly sleeping during that period. And you're going, wake up, baby. You, know, you want to play? So you have your baby now. So there's this transition period. And then after 24 hours, they wake up more and more. They get hungrier and hungrier. And you're kind of off to the races. But after you have your baby and your baby is in the bed with you, be very aware that you're not fully competent at that point. You're exhausted. You're recovering yourself from a very big deal. And so do not hesitate to put the baby in the bassinet next to your bed, or even to ask the nurses to take the baby out. But it is really important for you to be aware that you know, when you're sleeping, you're not competent at taking care of your baby necessarily. So make sure your baby's in a safe place.